Hello and welcome to my channel. In today's video, we'll see how to calculate PPF in Excel. PPF is nothing but the public profit fund. If in case you're a salary person or a person who has regular income, then this is considered to be one of the best and safest option available. Now, these are the set of rules with regards to PPF. You can contribute to this PPF account either on monthly basis or on yearly basis. Now, you can open this PPF account in any post office or any nationalized banks and even some of the private uh, banks do offer this PPF account. Now, the locking period of PPF account is 15 years. That is, to get a regular income, uh, you need to contribute for 15 years. But, you can partially withdraw on competing sits there. So after 6 years, you are permitted to withdraw 50% of the contribution amount or the balance, whatever it is left in your account. But there will be a penalty of 1% if in case you withdraw premature. And the interest rate is 7.1%. As of now, the interest rate is 7.51%. And this interest rate will keep on changing from quarter to quarter. It might increase or it may come down. And it is compounded annually. That is, uh, the interest, suppose uh, in this year's column I've given year 1, the interest that is earned in year 1 is again reinvested in year 2. That is, interest is earned on the interest. And then interest is calculated within close of the fifth day. So if in case you want to earn more interest, make sure that you deposit money before fifth of the month. So by keeping this set of fruits into consideration, we are going to uh, start our calculation. In this case, let's consider that we, uh, I've given it as yearly investment. Let's say I'm investing 12,000 per year, which means I'm contributing 1,000 per month. And this is the interest rate. Now, opening balance for the first year, it will be this 12,000. So I'll just start off with equal sign, select the cell B7 and then press enter okay now interest rate is nothing but this opening balance multiplied by this interest rate which is 7.1 will give me the actual interest rate start off with equal sign 12,000 into 7.1 percent and then press enter now next is closing balance my opening balance and the interest will give me the closing balance so, I'll start off with equal sign, opening balance plus the interest amount which is 852 and then press enter. So, this is the closing balance and for year 2, this closing balance will be carried forward which includes the interest amount which means the type of interest that is offered on PPF account is the compound interest. So for year 2, my opening balance will be, I'll start off with equal sign. Again, I'm going to invest 12,000 in the second year. I will lock the cell because every year I'm going to uh, make investment of 12,000. So just press F4 in order to lock the cell plus the closing balance of the previous year and then press N. And the, and the formula for the interest rate and the closing balance will remain the same. So just double click. In this case, I have typed till 15 years because the investment period is for 15 years. So just double click. And again double click the interest amount. And again double click the closing balance. In this case, I am getting the error because uh, I made two calculate this closing balance just double click automatically you get the value and make sure that you lock this uh, interest rate that is the reason I'm getting uh, this error so just press F4 in order to lock the cell and now the things must fall in place just double click and take so by investing 12,000 per year at the interest rate of 7.1%, I'm getting the uh, maturity amount 3,25,450 uh, approximately. So, we'll just quickly calculate the amount of uh, investment that I have made. So, 12,000 is the yearly investment I'm contributing for 15 years and that will come up to 1,80,000. 
and I'll start off with equals and I'll take this value and this is the uh, I'm getting this add sign because uh, uh, there is no much space for that particular number to get fit in so this is my maturity value so my maturity value minus my total contribution will get really interesting so in 15 years period of time I'm getting this one at 45,000 so this is the total interest amount so and uh, that concludes this video and also note that this is not give me, giving me the exact math. I am showing you the approximate math like how much, how exact, how much you can get by investing 12,000 per year at the rate of 7.1%. This is not showing the exact math because as I told earlier this interest rate keeps on changing. Here I have considered for all the years the interest rate as 7.1%. So approximately by investing 12,000 I am getting this much amount. In order to show the calculation of how the exact uh, value goes about happening. So probably I will upload in video in the future for your reference. And that concludes this video. Thank you for watching my video. If you find my video helpful do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Also click on the bell icon for further updates.